Hi guys, I'm going to share with you some simple ways for you to calculate how much loan you can get for buying a HDB. So let's say for example, your income is uh, $5,000. $5,000 and then you have uh, you are only able to use up to 30% of your income for the loan purchase itself. So 30% that will be $1,500 itself. You go and download this app called the Financial Calculators app. Sequence, you cl click under TVM Calculator. TVM calculator for a payment of $1,500 and if let's say for example uh, your age right now is only 25 or maximum 35 you can loan up to 30 years so how to calculate this formula so it's basically 65 minus away your age so at, at a maximum of 25 years so if let's say 65 your current age is 40 so 65 minus 40 is 25 if let's say you're 50, so it'll be 65 minus 50, that's 15. So it's 25 years or lesser. So 25 is the maximum. So it'll be uh so you rest and hold calculator will be 25 times 12. 30 months, uh, 300 months itself. So then the rate you can put in as uh 2.6%, that will be a HDB loan rate, or if not, uh HDB loan rate. Typically, then there will be a, and you click this PV button, and your estimated loan amount will be three hundred and thirty thousand itself. However, if let's say for example you are going for a bank loan, then you change this to three point five percent, and then you click, and it will be showing as three hundred thousand itself. So generally, uh, you can see that uh, HDB loan will give you a higher rate, whereas for a bank loan, it's slightly lower rate. So this is how you calculate how much loan you can get for a HDB. Follow me for part 2 where I'm going to share with you how much loan you can get for private property.